Good morning. Welcome to Medieval Dynasty. Ah, uh, and it's been a while since I've been in this. I've been doing too many games, I think. That and, you know, late night and early morning. Uh, but I think we ended up in a pretty good spot the last episode. Um, overall, we've been doing pretty decent. Got lots of progress made. Still a few things that I'd like to be able to get. Um, but otherwise, it hasn't been too bad. Progress on this has been going pretty steady. I really want to get to a market stall. And I, I don't think that uh, the amount of stuff that I've got at the moment is going to end up um, progressing too much. I have two... We've got two ladies that are pregnant at the moment. Uh, animal breeder and lumberjack, which means that... I am definitely going to need to find alternatives for those guys. I need some temporary people. This, oh, I wonder if they fixed this yet. They have. All right. So yeah, I don't never thought I'd be happy about things looking broken. So, this said it was broken before, and it wasn't. Like, it, I went to repair mode and it didn't show me anything. So, now it does, which is good. The movement is different. Seems different. Um, maybe it's just me. I don't know how many I need, but I'll do that. wish you could repair stuff that because you used to be able to repair stuff before it was broken and now you can only repair stuff when it's broken <sighs> I've got a few houses on the go I think uh, I don't know what's state they're in. I don't think there's any houses that I don't have people in. Yeah, I've got three houses that uh, need to be built. Uh, last episode I was able to reduce the number of buildings overall because of uh, the new um, honestly my brain is not working today um sorry I completely lost my train of thought there. 
because I was concentrating on something else. Uh, what am I at for? What? Uh. No tool. What tool? Bags? Are we out of bags? We are out of bags. Oh, huh. yeah. Uh, I guess we're making those. My wonderful new covered sewing table or sewing hut I know I ended up going on a tour of the villages to get uh, manure uh, to make f fertilizer that they want and <coughs> keep them happy It'd be interesting the animation change depending on what you were making. And I know why it's done this way, because it's easier, but I think it would be interesting. At least more interesting than just sitting here watching the same thing over and over again. Which seems to me all I ever do is watch the same thing over and over again. I can't imagine what it's like for anybody that actually does watch any of these videos. I'll probably just end up tuning out, which is why I don't get many people watching my videos. That's fine. I'm here to play a bunch of games and I am going to be playing a bunch of games regardless of whether anybody watches stuff or not so if somebody out there likes these videos and likes watching all the better Almost there. Almost there. Alright. Got bags going. Alright. That should make them happy. Does it make them happy? It doesn't seem to make them happy. So what else are they missing? They've got a bronze sickle right there, so it can't be that. They've got tons of hoes and sickles.
Uh, you should have lots of tools, buddy. Why don't you have lots of tools? Wish it would tell me what tool he's missing. Or what he thinks he's missing. Alright, tons of stew. Tons of pottage. Uh, I need to get some logs. Same amount. Oh, the warning's finally gone. All right, which building do I want first? It's the one farthest away. Probably make a path to there first. How about there? Should be good. Go straight up. Meet up with there. Careful, buddy. how many logs I need for this. I sat down and figured it out one day and Has the new update happened yet? The new update is has insta build, right? It has happened. Because there's photo mode and that's I don't want any of that. Fast building, fast crafting. Uh I'm gonna try these out. <clears throat> If you don't like this, let me know in the comments 
and I I'll take it back off but I think that this would make it a lot nicer for um, you guys watching um, I think I don't I don't think it's really cheating um, for this because I'm still playing I'm still um, oh this one isn't oh I just missed one okay well whatever um, I don't think insta build or insta crafting is necessarily cheating. Um, now, like unlimited weight and stuff like that, it does feel a little bit cheaty uh, for a full survival, but um, like I wish I had a discovered that before I ended up sitting there having to craft all that stuff, but <clears throat> I'm just thinking that it would make it a lot nicer for uh, people watching this, because then I'm not sitting there the entire time. <clears throat> I don't have the luxury of uh fast forwarding or um, uh, time lapsing the um, the footage so I think any way that I can make it a little bit more enjoyable for you guys uh, better that's basically the only reason that I would end up doing that for me it's like it's kind of like a break from the game I'm not insta building Do I need to restart the game first Or do I need all of the resources for it? <clears throat> Don't know how it works. Or, oh, maybe I didn't save the settings, maybe? Betcha I didn't save it. Uh, I didn't, I didn't save the settings, except changes, there we go, let's try that. I have a few logs in my inventory right now, so, the best one is, there we go. That's better. Yep. So that works. Only I didn't have... If only I had more inventory. Okay, how many blocks do I need left now? So... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 logs. And my question though is, does insta build affect stamina?
Because there's a stamina drain on building. Interesting. I'm wondering why whether that's the reason why the uh, movement seems a little off um, because of the update. They must have made improvements. I mean, they're constantly making improvements, so... Yeah, this is much nicer. You know, you don't notice it as much for the ones that have only one log in it, but you do notice it on the ones that have multiples. I think that's it. And I'm really gonna notice it for the, uh... But I didn't notice any stamina drain. I guess it removes the stamina drain as well. well that's unfortunate. That's one thing that I wouldn't mind. Uh, I think these guys are gonna need some water at some point because that's gonna. You know, Take a sidebar and fill up some buckets here. Oh, that's how it works. Well, that is nice. Well, at least it doesn't completely eliminate the animation on that you still have to cycle through one but it doesn't take forever to do all of them nope wrong one that's that's the wrong that's the wrong building i want to be over here well i do like that aspect of it um the fact that it at least maintains some of the animation, because I do like the animation on it. Um, it is, well, it's part of the immersion of the game, right? So uh, I don't need any more logs. I need stones. And if I recall correctly, I need 96 stones for some reason don't know why I think I need 96 stones I think that's total though yeah the only thing that I think that it would make the insta build a bit better is if there was if the stamina drain was still there so insta build but at least have the stamina drain because, like, I'm insta-building, and I'm not using any stamina whatsoever compared to what I was. I guess there's a little bit of stamina, but it's, it's only doing stamina drain from one hit, not from... 
So I only need 90 per... Oh, the six must be for the, the, the bottom part. What I'm thinking. No, ah, whatever, I don't know. I don't know if I'm just losing my mind. I mean, it could be. Did I miss a spot, maybe? I did. I did miss a spot. Right up there. That's... No. 94 is what I need, not 96. I need 80 planks for the roof. But I'm gonna do the stone first. Yeah, I think... I think the stamina drain needs to still be there. Like, still insta-mine, but take off the... Oh, sorry. Uh, I didn't see you there. Um, so... Like, still insta-build, but take off the amount of stamina that you would end up doing if you did the same number of hits. Right now, I can run over there and build an entire house with next to no stamina. Whereas before, uh, I'd end up having to take a rest halfway through. So it doesn't take it takes away the challenge of stamina con uh, conservation. But, I mean, the minor annoyance of... Or the, I guess it's not annoyance, it's... Uh, cheatiness? I don't know. I mean, it's not cheatiness. I mean, insta-build is kind of... It's not really cheaty. I don't know. I just... I think that if they had the... Stamina drain be exactly the same as before... That it would end up adding to the overall feel. Because, like, right now, um... Uh, where's building? Uh, I think this. These here? I, I have no reason to do that anymore. Like, I have no reason to... To increase these, so just by having that option on, it negates two tiers of the of the uh, the tech tree now if they added insta builds as an additional option to like uh, a maxed out option so uh for the tech tree uh, when you reach a certain point um, you can unlock insta mine or insta build for uh, for stuff um I think that that would be an interesting thing. But yeah, that's the only thing that I don't like about this insta build. Is the, uh, the stamina. But, I mean, it's, it's a minor, minor inconvenience. It's not, well, it's not even an inconvenience. It's, uh... Yeah, I think you know what I mean. 
Actually, you probably don't, but I mean. But I do like that option. Very much so. All right, so I need 80 planks. Probably build some fences around here. That would definitely increase my build. Um, experience. I don't know whether roads end up contributing towards the uh, building as well. I have exactly 80 planks. So you know what? I am gonna take uh, way too many planks. Over here, hopefully. And then Instacraft forty planks. Yay! I'm still carrying too much, but that's fine. I wonder if it also doesn't deplete the durability. Oh, that's... That's awful cheaty as well. So there's like no reason for me to... Yeah, I think... I mean, Instacraft, there's nothing, you don't, it doesn't cost you anything to begin with for that, so. But I don't know about Insta building. I mean, yeah, it saves me some time, uh, for the sake of my viewers, not that I have any viewers, I, I don't, I don't know if insta build is something that I'm gonna keep. Just because I don't, I don't think it's, it feels way too cheaty. I don't know. Let me know in the comments um, what you think, because uh, I I can't decide. Um, it just if the costs were still there. I think that that would end up being good. Or at the very least, if cost was, or if an insta build with the cost still attributed to it was available in the tech tree, I think that would l be less Cheaty. A 
Although I should check that to see if they've changed any of that. So... I mean, it's got less stamina and faster... See... See, right now, this, 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 and this is completely pointless with insta-build. But, I mean... In the same notes... This stuff is now pointless. I don't think these speed... I don't think the speed affects the villagers. It only affects the main character. So basically removing that removes the need to upgrade any of this stuff. Uh, yeah, I guess, I guess it doesn't matter because most of that is non-existent. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know. Let me in, let me know in the comments whether you think that I should um, should I keep building normal, keep all the progression the same. Um, it's gonna mean that it's not gonna be as interesting for the videos because. Um, you're gonna see just how agonizingly slow it is to build these things. Um, but at the same time, I'm gonna have the regular progression on. So, um, you'll still end up taking advantage of all the or you'll get to see all the other stuff but yeah let me know what you think um and i'll do whatever anybody wants because i am undecided on it personally i i think it's a flip of a coin for me because the advantages of insta build to me are kind of offset with the fact that um i'm gonna lose an entire uh uh section of the tech tree it's dark i'm gonna sleep Okay, uh, I'm going to take a quick break. Uh, I will be right back.
All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Okay, so where are we at? Uh, so we got three houses, which is good. <laughs> Means we can get six villagers. Um, do we need any villagers right immediately? I have four buildings I can still build. How might I fill those? I want at least one house available for the two pregnant women so that when they end up getting going on maternity leave I can um, fill their jobs temporarily until they get back um, I built a herbalist hut so I can do that what else so I've got one open spot on an excavation shed uh, it's not critical though because that's stone and I don't really, at this point, I really don't need stone. I could go with the herbalist hut. Um, there's always farmers. I got the pigsty, but pigsty is pointless without Oh, right, that's damaged. Um, that's that one, so I don't need to worry about that. Um, I could increase the smithy. And I could definitely use selling hut. Well, let's say that I only knew four villagers. That's Smithy. Excavation shed, because, um, it would be nice to have if I'm gonna increase the smithy production then I'm gonna need more stone got decent amounts of stone anyways but the more the merrier on that so that's two uh Sewing hut would mean that I can automate the bag production, which means that everything farming related would be completely automated. And then another farmer, I guess? So that's... Smithy... Excavation, Herbalist, Farmer. 
No. Smithy sewing excavation herbalist. So I need one survivalist, one excavator, a production and two production. The sound of babies. Mm -hmm. Our babies' laughs are just wonderful. Okay, uh, so I need two production. Survivalist and a excavator. Now I wonder if I should fill additional ones for now and get two more... Fill the houses that I've got. Because I've got at least another season before the... Pregnant women are gonna be going on maternity leave. I don't know... I mean, I didn't ask them when they... Messing around and got pregnant, so I mean, it's not like I know when they're gonna end up giving birth. It'd be nice to know, but I mean, you wouldn't really know in real life, so. Uh, I need to repair this, and I don't know what I need to repair. Oh, wow, that's trashed. You're not kidding, it needs repairs. Okay, well, let's go with this. Planks. So I've got logs in there, no planks. Alright. Oh. Huh. Well, whatever. Alright. So, that's done. Um, do I have anything to sell? Can I sell stuff while, while I'm here? Uh, I got lots of copper knives. Where are my stone knives? I don't think I'm making any, am I? Oh, I think I'm making some, but they're using the stone knives and not using the... They didn't add that feature in, did they? The ability to tell them to use something else? Nope. Uh, that's... If... if any developer is watching, or if you know how I can do this, how do I tell these guys to stop using stone knives and start using the higher end stuff that I've got? Because I want them to use the higher end stuff and I want to sell the lower end stuff, but they keep using the lower end stuff. 
Ugh. Villagers. Doesn't matter what game you're in, it's always a problem with the villagers. Okay, uh, what was I doing? I was gonna see what I can sell. Um... I can't sell anything. There's nothing here. I mean, I suppose I can sell off those things, because it's not like I need to... Not like I need to worry about that. Eight extraction. Why do those have extraction? Can I use hammers on nodes that's weird but I mean not really that bad well oh, forget it I can't figure it out so I mean uh, I'm here for some additional villagers so Okay. Hello. Hello. How are you today? Could you uh farming? Simple hard work. Oh, you're an extractor. Okay. Uh I am creating a new settlement. Welcome to the village. Uh you Where are you? There you are. Okay, you get this lovely house here. And I am going to set you up as... Wow, that's not... Uh, I'm going to set you up as a herbalist. I don't know why... But that seems like the best, the right thing to do. Uh, herbalist hut. It's considered extraction? Huh. Well, what do you know? Okay. Let's pick some berries. And some poisonous stuff. And some mushrooms. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna just... Put everything into other stuff, and then we'll see where we go. I don't care about any of that stuff. Honestly, the potions... I really don't have... much of a need for potions. I don't... Uh, feeling of thirst. This is for hunger. Loss of stamina. I'm gonna increase that. 
Uh, health loss when poisoned. Eh, it would be better just, like, stop being poisoned, right? So let's do that. Collect up all the mushrooms, and then... The rest is berries. I think that should be good. Alright, next. How are you today? Can you tell me something about your skills? Uh, gain others trust. That means you are something that I don't need. Uh, oh. No, that's... Uh, I do need you. Uh, so, you are an extractor. Great, see you there. Uh, where am I at? I need you to be here. Uh, sure. That's a good spot as any. Now, you are extraction. Diplomacy, survival, production. I want you as an extractor. I think. You're not much of a farmer. You are going to go there, I think. How is life treating you? Not bad, buddy. Fishing or finding mushrooms. That's all you're good at. Uh, I am not taking a chance on you, buddy, so I am just going to let you go. And now we're going to take a quick bath. Not because we have to, but because we can. And we'll drink some water at the same time. Potentially poison ourselves. I mean, it's just drinking from the lake. Pick up a parasite. Okay. Nature's weight loss professional. Okay, uh... Hey, old friend. Tracking prey. That's all. Field work makes you insane. Okay, so you're not a farmer. You're not a miner or anything. Hunter, that's it. Okay, well, I'm sorry, buddy. Or... Er Lady, I don't need you. Hello there. Oh, you're an extractor. Hunter. You know what? No, you're not a crafter, but that doesn't matter. I'm going to do that. And then... What I'm going to do is I'm going to change... Uh... Not her. 
going to change this person. Oh, wow. Yeah. So you are going to change to production. Uh, what production should you be? Uh, you are going to be a blacksmith. And then you... You need a house. Enjoy your new house, buddy. Uh, and this is... He is a great extractor, so... He is gonna go to there. Alright, so I've used up all the villagers that are here. Uh, so how many do I need? I need three more villagers to fill up these houses. I need one girl and a girl and a guy. Hopefully close enough in age that they are going to have fun together and make some babies and so that by the time I am finally at end game, they will finally, finally be old enough to actually do anything with. I'm pretty sure I've gotten everything from here, haven't I? Yep. Yep, I have. Uh, for some reason, I... I'm thinking that I probably should not have been wandering into the forest. Because this is Wizen area. Wizen? Yeah. I got the stuff from that one? Looks like it. No. I want to go to there. So I need another lady, you are not, uh, I think you're a villager, so no, that's not going to work. You are a villager. Well, I can suppose I can see what you guys are like. Farmer. Uh, you are a production person. So, you get to live in that house. And I'm gonna put you in... Where? Sewing hut. Now, we're going to need some work for you to do. So, let us start with... Some simple bags. In fact, that is all you're going to do because... That's all I have for you. Uh, Eight point four. What am I making at the hunting lodge? 
I am making 62.09 per day. So, I think he can handle that. Okay. Uh, I need two ladies that are going to at least tolerate these poor guys. And make me jealous, because... They get to enjoy the advantages of married life without all the troubles. I mean, at this point in my life, I even like the troubles just to, you know, have the happily married life part. Okay. How can I help you? Could you tell me something? Uh okay. Uh simple work. So you are an extractor. Not hunting. Person, ass person. Well, that's fine. I don't get like getting along with other people either. Uh, you know what? I am gonna take a chance on you. Oh, really? Oh, well, apparently, I can't hire anybody. Because I don't have enough reputation to get another worker. Uh, well, that kibosh is that. Uh, we can at least get her situated. Pick a house, any house. It doesn't matter where you are. Extraction. Ah. Oh, um. I'm gonna put you here for now. I think you're one of the ones that I don't actually need you to be there, but... It's as good a place as any. I mean, you're gonna end up getting to be amazing at extraction, so... Uh... So this guy, this guy is not as good at extraction. So I'm going to switch there to there. What's this guy? No worker. Ah, because... Um, now, there should be an out-of-work guy. If I can just... Uh, 
What are you good at? You are good at hunting, farming, and survival. So I am going to put you as a farmer, I think. Uh, you know what? Yeah. I, I don't know, I just... The well seems like a completely useless... I mean, it's an important enough job, but it just, it seems like you don't really need to do a whole lot to fill water. Um, uh, like, everybody is overqualified for the well. There's much better spots for them to be. Um... So, apparently I need to increase my reputation somehow and quests are what I need to do so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, load up on things that I would need for a an exploration and overall thing. Uh, no, actually what I'm going to do is I am going to do some mining. some food. Probably not a lot of food, but hey. Good enough. Okay, let's get some mining done. Now that would be useful. Is there an insta... insta mine? No, uh, customize the game. Uh, unlimited stamina. No, I don't want that. Fast crafting, fast building. There is not a an option. Oh, now that's interesting. Length of season in days. I can increase the number of days in a season. I'm not going to do that because then it would really take forever. No, I don't see... I don't see anything there. But even that, with insta-building, they'd probably have the same thing as that uh, durability is not going to be there and the stamina reduction is going to end up not being there either, so I suppose it's good for 
for that. For the insta build and the insta crafting, um, I think I might do a poll on that. Um, and see if it's something that people would be interested in um, helping me decide what to do because I'm kind of on the fence with it as as much as I like the idea that I can um, save people the aggravation of watching me craft stuff for hours. At the same time, it just it negates a lot of stuff. A lot of things that um, the tech tree I, I don't need anymore because there's no point to it. Although I suppose it's still going to end up... The increase in speed is still going to end up at least improving this time. So... It should make it a little bit faster for when I'm uh, just for the the one that I need to build. But again, it's like it's gonna end up negating a lot uh, of other options that I, or a lot of uh, decision making that I would normally end up having to take into consideration, especially like stamina drain for the uh, for the building. I don't know. But yeah, I can't I can't decide whether that's a good idea or not. I need to boost my reputation points somehow. Um, I've got a couple of quests. Oh, what are... Oh, you know what? Um, I imagine that the well person is out of resources. Yep, yep, they are. Okay, well... Well... Welly, well, well, well. Water carrier. So what else are you good at? You're good at hunting, farming, and survival. Uh, farming's basically the only job that's available for you, buddy. Yep. Uh, Do I have anything that the barn needs? I don't think I have any work for him. Yeah, because everything's been processed. I'm waiting for... materials to come in. So, I don't have any work there. So, I guess just... Uh, 
guess just that. Okay, that should be fine. Oh, but now I don't have any person working there. So... I need to dial this down to zero. And I'm carrying too much. So let's take this stuff back here. Try and get all the mining done um, before the night uh, before the next change of days. And hopefully Hopefully I can get this mine cleared out before that happens. What am I at for stone? Should have tons of stone, right? Yeah, I've got lots of stone. You know what I might do? Just to speed things up a little bit is I am going to drop all of the stone that I pick up and just get the base materials that I need. And then if If I feel like it, I'll come back and get the stone later. But if not, then if it if it degrades and goes away, that is I am not going to be sad. I think I'm at that point where stone is not as important as it used to be. Especially since I've got tons of extractors getting stone. In fact, since I'm... Since I'm planning on dropping the stone, I'm just gonna max out my inventory until I can't move anymore and then drop the stone. Woodshed 2, awesome! That is actually really good. Uh, I need to drop. Nope, no, nope, that's not what I want. Uh, don't run away, don't run away. Come on, come back. Thank you. Uh, no, that is that. I want to drop everything. Okay, so we have our next steps because the woodshed 2 
is something that I really wanted to be able to do. Because uh, right now I have like four or five wood sheds. And woodshed two lets me have two people per building. Which means that I can either reduce the number of buildings that I have by doubling up the people in them, or I can increase the number of people that I have and diversify things a lot better. Um, because I've been concentrating on certain things like uh, building materials, which is all well and good, but uh, there's other materials that I do need as well, um, specifically sticks. Um, I need sticks for crafting. I don't need it for building anymore, but I do need it for other things. So that should help me maximize a few things as far as efficiency is concerned. It'll free up a couple of... At the very least, I should be able to at least free up one. Is, uh, let's take a look here. Yeah, woodshed too. And I'm almost there to the mine. So I only have like... Twice the experience of everything that I've done already. To get to the mine, but it should be all right. Um, right now, I have three wood sheds. Um, and if I can increase the number, either D Increase the number of people in um, the sheds that I've got, or at the very least, uh, decreasing the overall buildings, that should be good. I don't even know whether my firewood situation is good at the moment. Uh, I think I've already got too much it's fine. Wow, oh, bronze pickaxes are really awesome, by the way. I might actually be able to... finish mining. I think I've depleted all the bronze and copper now. Now it's just a matter of picking up the uh, excess stone. And even if I don't pick it up, that's fine too.
Well, since it appears that I don't need to worry about that. I'm going to drop that at least. Because one bronze pickaxe seems to be more than enough for what I need. Alright, so this should be all the nodes taken care of. Um... I'm leaving salt. I don't really care about salt. Get this back. I wish it highlighted the nodes in the hunting that like this. I mean, you can't really see in the dark, but I don't remember that feature. What it's called? Where you where you kind of go into like a trance thing and you it shows you where like this. I wish that it also showed the nodes. Uh, I am not doing that. In fact, I don't need a pickaxe anymore. Unless I've missed a node, but I think I've done a pretty good job of cleaning this out, so I, I don't know. Uh, I'm just going to ignore any additional nodes. I'll pick up all the stone that I've got and call it a day because I think, I think that's good. I mean, for all I know, I'm not going to even be able to call it a day. Should be some stone in here, I thought. Apparently not. Oh, there we are. Over there. I think that's it. Yeah. Okay, we're done. And I am pretty sure that I've gotten all the nodes here. I don't think I've missed anything. Yeah, so that's, that's it. Another season's mining is done and we are halfway towards opening up our own mine here and potentially opening mines in other areas although I don't know whether I'd end up doing that or not I don't know okay so uh Tell you what, I am going to take advantage of the day and I am going to do this. Extraction, woodshed two, there. Now, what do I need to... I need a log and six planks and then I will need to reassign at least one guy to this a log what did I say two planks or six I don't remember 
I'm just gonna get a bunch of them just in case. Whoops. Ah, oh, well, that's disappointing. Hi. Uh, yeah. What's my housing situation? available and I'm pretty sure this is a dude and I think there's only one I think the fishing guy is the next one Yeah, I think the fishing guy is the next guy in this um, quest chain. Uh, let's put that on pause. Uh, I am going to upgrade one of these guys here. Quickly. And now, so I need to get, we got two unemployed. Villager, oh, cause what? Oh, cause yeah, um, yeah, they are too young to work. Uh, okay, you. Uh, you are gonna go where? Woodshed 2. And there should be one more guy that's out of work. There isn't? Why is there... Oh! Did they fix that? I don't think they did. Oh, you know what? I think I... I only have two extractors. And I have two Two new babies here, which is awesome. So that means that I have two new mothers, which also means that one of you guys needs to go over here. You are gonna go over there. Perfect. Okay, so... Who are you? Bed Ghost. Building must be constructed. Oh, cause, yeah. Alright, well, this is fine. Um, Hen House. 
I need one of you guys to go to the hen house, which are... I am going to... Uh, I'm going to what? Uh, it's a flip of a coin. Either I have this guy be the lowest level farmer which means I'm going to get less stuff. Or I... Because I don't know if this farming level affects how much they plant and stuff. Or whether it makes no difference whatsoever. Yeah, either way, it's not going to work well. Yeah, I'm just going to have to... I'm going to do it low level. Um, and hope that... I increase the population of these guys enough. Um, I, I don't. I don't see any other way of doing this. Food storage is damaged. Okay. That's fine. Which shed two. I need to review the wood sheds. So this is fourteen fifty five twenty six. Yeah, I need to adjust these. But I'm going to have to think about this. I'm going to have to come back. Uh, I will be just a moment.
Sorry about that. I'm back. Okay. So. What do I do with this? I have... Definitely need to adjust this. So 65, 20, 10. 65, 20, 10. 65, 20, 10. Got them working on the same levels. Except for this one. This one is working on. Sticks. So I guess that's fine. Um, I'm just going to remove this. And I think I'm just going to leave it as is. Because if I renew or um, get this one set up and add to it in future, uh, it I don't necessarily need to worry about that. Um, okay, so. I think this is fine for now. I think that gets everybody working as they need to. There's no missing spots um, where it doesn't need to be. Uh, we definitely need some farmers, but the only way that I can... I don't have enough workers. I need to increase my worker availability. Uh, don't don't know what to do. Cause number one, you know what? I'm gonna have to do some quests. Uh, and I'm probably gonna have to power through them. Okay, what do I need? I need one of those. Uh, take all of these guys. And I'm going to take a couple of those. I don't have enough of that linen thread. I don't have enough of that. Uh, let's take a few of these. With these, got that.
Okay. I don't think I have enough linen thread to do what I need to. Which means I'm gonna end up having to take a trip. So wooden weapons... Yeah, I need... I need three more... Three more for that. Uh, I'm going to see about building the highest level of arrow. I build bronze arrows? I cannot. Because I'd need to sell stuff. Can I do copper? I can, except that I don't have copper. I can make 60 with the amount that I've got. So I can do a couple of things. One is I can try and get some money to be able to do that. That still only gets me... That still only gets me 10 bronze. Which would be good. Uh, but it also means that I don't have enough. I have more bronze than I do copper. So what I might do, I'm going to do this. I'm going to sell all of that stuff. I'm going to dump that. I'm going to take that. whether that's wise or not. Uh, okay, what can I sell? I'm gonna sell those guys. And these uh, what else can I sell? I honestly don't know what I can get away with. I uh, can sell a bunch of food. Whoops, sorry buddy. Uh, I think that's about as all, uh, 
about all I can do, I think. I'm gonna sell some food. See how much I can get for the stuff that I've got. Uh, try and do a couple of... Try and do a couple of quests. Get my reputation up. I don't know what else I can do. I'm really hoping that I've got some time for the spouse quests. Because number one, I won't be able to finish the quest uh, to be able to get the villager. Which is a problem, because I mean that's basically the whole point of the, the quest. You get reputation points increase and um, additional things from that, but um, doing all of that and not getting the amazing villager out of it is kind of meh, right? I mean... Why would... Why would I want to spend all that time on the quest and then not get the villager out of it? So, I mean, one alternative is that I... Farmer. Oh, right, that's the... yeah, uh, I, I'm, I'm an idiot. Yep, 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 yep. Uh... Okay. Okay. Oh, I was going to sell that stuff, too. Uh, oh, well. Um... Uh... Let's say, like... Sure. 25? Sure. That should be good. Right now, I'm gonna s I'm gonna sell everything that isn't bolted down. How are you? Best goods in the valley. I'm selling those, even though those are, um, unique, they're, they're honestly kind of pointless. Alright, so I've got, Goodbye. I've interrupted her train of thought and she has been 
and she's stuck okay so uh i need to get to Branica, i think i can never remember there's two similar named places and um Oh, and I need, uh, where is it? Need to unlock you. Which basically depletes all of my resources. Uh, I need smithy two for bronze arrows. And now I need linen thread. Which I need to get to Ranica or uh, wherever it is. Yeah, Ranica. And then I can get some linen thread and take the linen thread and turn it into a recurve bow and the bronze into bronze arrows and that should maximize the stuff that I'm doing now I was thinking the hunting aspect of it to do the uh, chapter 8 a big game quest because uh, I only need three I only need to hunt one of each of these things uh, a moose a wizent and a bear uh, the moose are pretty easy to to get. They're actually near, right nearby uh, of my village, and it wouldn't take me long to um, to hunt one of them. Not a big deal. And the additional meat for it wouldn't be that bad either. So, like, it's win-win. That's it? Oh, no. Iron knife and bronze bolt. It would be nice if those highlighted. Is that everything? I guess so. I don't see anything else here, right? You don't see anything? I don't see anything. Eh, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, um, yeah, so I think that... That would be 
good. But I also think that if I can get the Unighost story out of the way, um, I've already played that like 40 times. Or no, that's an exaggeration, but you know what I mean. Um, it's it's more time consuming than anything else. Uh, what was I doing? Oh, I was not stopping here. I was going to this village over there, and you know what? I'm gonna take a quick stop at this like mini village over here. My outpost. And see what I've got here. The Wizen and Bear are somewhat difficult, but I mean they're still manageable. Uh, it's it's not it's not that bad. Uh, I'm gonna take that. Got lots of cabbage. I really need to sell cabbage somehow. You know what? I'm gonna do this. Hey, no, I'm not gonna do that because that's way too much. Uh, because I'm actually selecting the wrong thing. That's the reason why. Okay. This I am going to sell. This. Yeah, sure. That's that's good. Okay. Yeah, the wise and bears are are difficult. But the biggest issue with them is they attack. Hello. Best goods in the uh, moose, no big deal. Uh, I don't have to worry about anything regarding that. Uh, all right, let's sell you. And now I need linen thread. And you know what? How much money do I have? I can buy up to seven. I need four for that. So I think. Yeah, I think what I'm going to do is I'll set up for that, do some exploring, uh, finish off some quests, try and spam through the, uh, uh, the additional quests that I've got. No, that's the wrong thing. I need you. No, I need you. Bronze weapons, bronze arrows. I will make maximum, so I've got 60 bronze arrows available to me. Uh, now, that should be more than enough for what I need for this. Uh, I will get all of that there. I think that should be good. Uh, I will also need a bronze 
hammer. In fact, I'm gonna take two bronze hammers. And the reason for that is that that's kind of the trick with Wizent. And that is fences. Fences are awesome. Fences stop Wizents from getting to you. So the I'll sh I'll show you later, but I mean Um but yeah, I think I think that's going to be the next thing that I end up working on. Um so but I think that's going to have to be it for me today. Uh YouTube is complaining that I'm not getting enough throughput so it's probably uh yep i am dropping frames on my network so um i think that's a good opportunity to end this video uh next time hopefully i will get some hunting in uh i don't know whether i'm going to do that on screen i might do some off screen work i don't know uh, but we'll see um but yeah Thank you very much for watching. If you like the video, please like, subscribe. If you want to stay up to date on the content that I produce, uh, definitely subscribe. If you want to join in on the streams, I stream every day about 5 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, but days like today that I have off, I end up uh, doing it a bit later. And sometimes when I end up working earlier, I end up starting earlier as well. And sometimes I... Uh, do afternoon streams so subscribe and you will get notifications on when i start the stream um and then you can jump on comment uh say hello if you want uh offer suggestions comment anything like that is all 